afternoon and welcome. Welcome everyone to the Huntsville Police Department's promotion ceremony. On behalf of the entire command staff that you see here to my right, I want to thank all of you officers, employees, your family members, all the friends here today, retired officers, and all the members of the community who have taken their time to come out and support these officers and what's going on here today. Big, big day in their life. Before we get started, I'd ask, like to ask our, one of our public safety chaplains, Chaplain Rob Peavy of the Huntsville Madison County Public Safety Chaplain to give the invocation. Would everyone please rise? While you're standing, as we think of setting these aside for promotion today, Joshua received a little promotion, a big promotion actually, when Moses died. And three times in chapter 1, the Lord told him to be strong and courageous. Verse 6, be strong and courageous for you will distribute the land. Haven't I commanded you to be strong and courageous? Don't be afraid or be discouraged for the Lord your God is with you wherever you go. And the end of the chapter exceeds again strongly above all be strong and courageous let's bow father i thank you as these folks have decided to be strong and courageous some years back and graduated from our academy and chosen to serve our city in the line of duty where they would charge into harm's way when others would run in the other direction father when they would get up in the morning and put on body armor to go to work in madison county and in huntsville most people are sitting behind a desk or uh, standing behind others. But these people are out front, Lord. They're leading the way, always serving, always guiding, always protecting, and therefore they are our police officers. Thank you so much for their promotion today, for them taking on more responsibility, uh, more opportunity to stand between others and a, and a trial, if you will. But today, Lord, we just want to set them aside for promotion and celebrate this time. For their families, Lord, I pray that they would put God first, put their wives second, put their children third, and then their police duty, Father, because when you serve God, you have enough love and admiration and ability to serve others, Lord, in an abundant way. Father, I close with a verse from Matthew that says, Jesus did not come to be served, but to serve others and to give his life as a ransom for many. And as we have even seen this month, Lord, some have given their lives in the line of duty. I pray a hedge of protection around these and each of my uh, leaders to the right and the promotionals to the left. We just ask that you'd put that protection around them. Guard and guide and lead them and give them your strength. We give it to you today in Jesus' name. And all God's family said. Amen. To each of these seven who are going forward to... Uh, take on greater responsibility in the department. I want to say thank you. Thank you for your service. Uh, thank you for your past service because it has been service and service to the community and you've made the community a better place. Because of what you've done in the past, you have been recognized and now you'll move forward and do, do even more for our community, for this department, for the city of Huntsville. Thank you for your service and to each of the families out here, thank you. I know there's a lot of long nights, uh, long days, holidays, everything else that you miss. Some of, some of your loved ones not, maybe not being there because they're out working, they're serving others, and they're making sure that this community is a safe place. Thank you for your sacrifice because it is a sacrifice. But to each of you, to those who much is given, much is required, and we look forward to having much being required of you. We know that from your past experience that you will provide, again, excellence in performance, and you will make this department the best department that you can find in the world. Thank you so much. The Huntsville Police Department has enjoyed a long, rich history. I've had the pleasure to serve in several different areas of this department throughout my career, including investigations, uh, I can proudly say we have the best department in the country today. This is made possible by the support of every member of the department, by our volunteers, many of which are here today, by other city departments that pitch in and help the police department in their functions, and especially by the community. We have a tremendous community outreach program in this police department. I appreciate the support and dedication of each one of you, and I'm honored to be your chief. The seven officers standing before you now are about to embark on an exciting new role in their police careers. Being an investigator is a real challenge, and yet it's also highly rewarding. 
you get to deal with all phases of criminal uh, of crime really in, in, involving responding to the scene to see the scene while it, it just occurred you get to uh, interview the suspects you get to build that case and testify in court and go up against some of the sharpest lawyers in the country it's quite a challenging job as members of the Criminal Investigation Division, these new investigators will be part of some exciting new changes in the Huntsville Police Department. One of those is breaking our investigators down into very specialized subgroups. And you're going to have to work very hard, learn some new trade tra crafts, and gain knowledge of new investigative techniques and trends that are going on. And it's my honor now to recognize each and every one of these. Uh, Officer Daphne Treese. She served with the police department for 15 years. She's currently assigned to the Internal Affairs Division and previously served as a patrol officer and member of the Bike Patrol Unit. And Investigator Treese, congratulations on your promotion. Thank you. <laughs> Next up is Officer Gerald Bowling. Officer Bowling served with the Huntsville Police Department for 13 years. He's currently assigned to the patrol division where he's previously served as one of our field training officers. With his promotion to investigator, Officer Bowling will now be assigned to the South Precinct as a member of the General Investigation Squad. Investigator Bowling, congratulations on your promotion. <laughs> officer Jason Clark has served as an officer with the Huntsville Police Department for 13 years. He's currently assigned to the Internal Affairs Division as well as the Bomb Squad. He's also a state certified fire investigator and with his promotion to investigator, Officer Clark will be assigned to the Robbery Burglary Investigative Squad. He'll continue to serve as a member of the Bomb Squad in his duties. And Investigator Clark, congratulations on your... He's currently assigned to the patrol division, and with his promotion to investigator, Officer Salas will now be assigned to the North Precinct as a member of the General Investigation Squad. Investigator Salas, congratulations on your promotion. <laughs> All right, next up is Officer Kevin Carlisle. He served with the Huntsville Police Department now for eight years. He's currently assigned to the patrol division, but with his, his promotion to investigator, Officer Carlisle is going to be assigned to the North Precinct as a member of the General Investigation Squad. Investigator Carlisle, congratulations on your promotion. <laughs> he is currently assigned to the Special Operations Division as member of the DUI Task Force. He also serves the department as, as a member of our Honor Guard. He's previously served as a traffic homicide investigator as well. With his promotion to investigator, Officer Vogel will now be assigned to the West Precinct as a member of the General Investigation Squad. Investigator Vogel, congratulations on your promotion. <laughs> Putman served with the department now for six years. He's currently assigned to the patrol division where he also serves as one of our field training officers. I believe also you're one of our traffic homicide investigators as well, which is a, a unique job. With his promotion to investigator, Officer Putman will be assigned to the West Precinct as a member of the General Investigation Squad. And I'm going to keep you on as a traffic homicide investigator for a while too, if you don't mind. You're very good at that. I'm not letting you out of that yet. Uh, Investigator Putman, congratulations on your promotion. <laughs> 